Yesterday's video was um, the methodology of being able to ease the communication between your inner and your outer selves. And I think that a really good exercise to do that is in community where like those, those voices that communicate are not always easy to hear. They're not always easy to get in alignment. Um, and they're not always easy to access and in community specifically, I'm going to speak on my own behalf in the community of the sisterhood with all of us going for the same type of communication with our inner selves and then secondarily to get back to the selves it's it's never a case of discovery it's always a case of remembrance so it's really are you willing to open up the lines of communication from your inner to your outer self, the world that you live in and who you are at your core. Because listen, we all must take on roles that lay over that. Motherhood is is part of who you are, but it's also a role and an essential one and so important. So I'm not trying to lessen the importance of roles, but what I'm saying is there also needs to be a place where just the core of you, the raw core of you is seen heard and appreciated. And a really good way to do that as a self practice is the communication of inner to outer self. A really dynamic way to establish that practice is in a group of community. So what I am proposing to you is if this is something that you are hungry for, that I am hosting a workshop at the end of August and I'm happy to send you the details if you just comment below and it's all about your communication with your inner and outer selves. How do you bring that into the world that you live in now? How do you provide your own root and sense of safety so you don't have to look for it outside yourself and really just allowing yourself to ground into yourself and the earth as a place of stability, everything that grows from that point needs to be from a place of stability, man or woman. Now, this group is specifically for my sisters because I think I'm very excited to to talk about co-ed. I think the power of bringing um, masculine and feminine energy together is so dynamic and it's so exciting to me. But this specific group, I really want the intimacy of a woman with her sisters being able to mine things that she maybe wasn't even aware was there. And, and in the container that we'll all build together, you will be in a place and you will be given tools and techniques to do that. So if this is something that speaks to you, if this resonates with you, if your inside either child or teenager suddenly just came up roaring behind you, maybe this is something that you say, you know, let's connect, let's connect. And that is what I wanted. That's what I want to offer. That's my testimony. It's what's been coming up for me. And it is what I am drawn to bring out in my own life and just live by demonstration. And I will see you tomorrow.